Every woman certainly has a different body shape, including breasts. The shape and size of the breasts, especially the nipples, is a concern for breastfeeding mothers. This is because several nipple-related problems can hinder the process of breastfeeding your little one, one of which is flat or inverted nipples. Flat nipples are caused by many things, such as fat in the breast, the length of the milk ducts, breast milk, changes in the shape of the nipples during pregnancy and after childbirth, and the density of connective tissue at the bottom of the nipples. If you experience it, you don't need to worry. Because breastfeeding can still be done. In the following, we will provide information on how to safely and comfortably breastfeed with Flat Nipples Healthline. 1. Express milk by hand before starting to feed. Sometimes hard and flat nipples can occur when the breast is full of milk. For this reason, you can try to express breast milk using your hands first before starting to breastfeed. Here's how. Hold the breast with one hand, while the other hand makes a C shape with the thumb and forefinger, then place it near the areola. Squeeze gently and then release the pressure. Mama can repeat this method several times. Usually the liquid drip will appear before the milk starts to flow. Remember to press and squeeze just enough. Because the goal is only to soften the breasts and remove flat nipples. 2. Stimulate the nipples so that they can tighten or get erect, so that mama can breastfeed her little one. Usually the nipple will be erect or stiff when stimulated. Therefore, mama is advised to stimulate it so that the nipple can come out. If this method works, chances are that the baby can breastfeed well. Here's how. Place your thumb and forefinger on the tip of the areola, the dark area around the nipple. Massage gently and do it slowly. Do the same on both of mama's breasts. 3. Use a breast pump to help withdraw the nipple. Flat nipples are of course a concern for mothers who are breastfeeding. Considering that your little one needs an adequate supply of breast milk to support his growth and development. For the sake of smooth breastfeeding, another way that can be done is to pull the nipple out by using a breast pump. Usually a breast pump can help, especially for mothers who have flat nipples or very deep, drown. Mama can try pulling the nipple out using a manual or electric breast pump. 4. Use a tool or device that can pull the nipple out. On the market, you may find a device or suction device that can be used to pull out flat or sunken nipples. But usually, these products are sold under different names. For example, nipple extractor or nipple retractor. This tool will work by loosening the tissue around the nipple and help pull it out. Mama can use it under clothes to pull out the nipple, so that breastfeeding becomes more comfortable. 5. Use a nipple shield or nipple shield. Nipple shield is a nipple-shaped breast shield that can be used around the areola or nipple. But this one tool is usually used for temporary relief. The nipple shield functions to encourage good attachment when your little one is suckling, and helps pull out flat nipples. You can put it under the clothes you wear every day, and use it between feedings. 6. Stimulate the nipples with the Hoffman Technique. Apart from gently and slowly stimulating the nipples, you can also stimulate the nipples using the Hoffman Technique. The Hoffman Technique was created to help women who are breastfeeding and have flat or inverted nipple problems. A study in 2017 found that the Hoffman Technique can effectively increase the ability of the nipples to channel milk, so that the breastfeeding process becomes more optimal and of good quality. Here's how to do the Hoffman Technique. Place your index finger and thumb on either side of the nipple. Press your fingers firmly into the breast tissue. After that, gently stretch the areola in each direction. 7. Holding the breast while breastfeeding so that attachment can occur properly. Holding your breast while breastfeeding is another way you can do if you have flat nipples. Holding the breast also aims to make attachment occur properly, so that the baby can get more breast milk. There are two ways you can do them. Holding the breast by forming the letter C. Holding the breast in a C shape will allow you to control the movement of the breast. This will also make it easier for mama to direct the nipple, so that it fits better in the baby's mouth. You can do this by placing your thumb and forefinger behind the areola or the black part around the breast. Holding the breast by forming the letter V. Holding the breast can also be in the shape of the letter V ma. The trick, mama only needs to use the index and middle fingers so that they form a scissor-like shape around the areola and nipples. Then press the two fingers gently towards the chest, of course, to help get the milk out of the nipples. That was the safe and comfortable way to breastfeed with flat nipples.
Breastfeeding with flat or inverted nipples can be difficult. But don't let this discourage you from breastfeeding your little one. If you feel worried or uncomfortable, you can consult a doctor or lactation consultant to find the best way to breastfeed your little one.